Ah, yes, nothing on the schedule today, eh, Maurice? We can just sit back, relax, and... But, Your Majesty, do you not remember the party we've been planning? It is set for today. Oh, yeah, the party. It's all coming back to me now. Sometimes the immense pressure of being your king causes me to forget the smallest of details. What time do we plan on kicking this thing off? Well, actually, right now. Ooh, right. So, what do we do? You are the king, sir. Perhaps you should lead the dance music portion of our event. But of course, I will address the crowd with my authoritative yet approachable fashion. All right. If I could just say a few words, I'd be a better public speaker. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> <coughs> Whoa, tough crowd. Anyway, let's get this party started, shall we? Follow the beat of the song and watch these symbols. When they line up with the button, you just got to press that button, man. Press that button that matches the symbols. See, it's not so hard. Just stay with the rhythm. So, <clears throat> are you guys ready to do this? Yay! Yeah! I cannot hear you. No, seriously, I really can't hear what you guys are saying. I still have that ear infection. We said yeah! Splendid! Then let us get going. Oh, wait. Before we start, does anybody need to use the bathroom? I don't want another episode like the one we had last week. Bathroom? Anybody? No? Okay.
Par for the course. Saving the bacon of those New York giants, I like to tinker on my beautiful tiki golf course. It's the trickiest one on the whole island. Uh, oh yeah, it's the only one. Bet you want to know how to play.
Just hit the pearl ball with this stick into these holes. Sounds easy, right? Wrong! But wrong in a kind of a cute and endearing way. Jeez, Mutt, just get on with it. Okay, see, it would be easy to hit the ball into the holes if it weren't for all the treacherous corners, ramps, and nasty gizmos I've installed. There are nine holes, each unique in a fiendishly clever way, if I do say so myself. You begin each hole by choosing the direction you want to hit the ball. Then you press the action button to bring up the swing meter. The meter will rise and fall. Rise and fall. Rise and fall. You are growing sleepy. You want to give Mort all your precious metals. You... Mort, I told you before, hypnosis doesn't work. Then press the action button again to set your swing straight. <coughs> the higher the meter, the stronger your stroke. Be careful, though, about hitting the ball too hard. First off, they're pearls which are expensive to replace. Also, if you hit the ball really hard, it may not go in exactly the direction you want. And if you approach the hole too quickly, the ball may sail right over it. Your final score is the total of all your hole scores added up. The player with the lowest number wins. Uh, just like politics. Mart! That's it! The best score for the course is saved with your game, so you can challenge your friends to a round or two. Good luck!
chop that up to zebra power. Board. Game of Kings. But to play with Banash, you will have to learn the rules. The goal is to be the first player to score 15 points. Players take turns sliding pucks down the board. After all eight pucks are thrown, only one player will score. They get points for all of their pucks that are past the deepest opponent puck. The pucks are worth the value of the scoring zone they are in. If you really mess up and don't even throw your puck past the power zone, your puck is removed with extreme prejudice. The idea is to throw your puck deep down the board past all the enemy pucks, which is known as lagging. But don't forget blocking. It can be just as important. Don't forget the combo. And if your puck comes to rest sticking off the far edge, it's a hanger. worth four points. When you've mastered the basics of shuffleboard, you may want to try the fun and exciting variants, each set at its own special location. The rules for Tiki Shuffle remain the same, however, bumpers along both sides and in the center have been added. The center bumper is a permanent block, but the bumping action provides the means to circumnavigate it. There's a big juicy scoring zone down there with four and five zones added. Finally, there is the Antarctic Icy Curve Shuffleboard. The sinuous journeys the pucks take on this icy board open up a whole new category of shot making. Delicious. In one shot, you can go around other pucks using them as blocks. And of course, also knock off pucks that seem completely blocked. Juicy sweet, juicy sweet. Yeah.